farming well, but he has been caught here in the Chrono, not the Chrono, the, the, the Mars ulti. He manages to spin away, but there's still three dire heroes around him, including this fucking Timbersaw. Has to Omni to get the kill on Yakuro. His team's arrived though, and he's safe. Phil! Looking at very much in danger at the moment. Oh, the chain misses. There's no tree, Phil. There's no tree. Okay, all right, I am without an analyst today. It's just me, me and my boring, boring, boring cast. Okay, let's see what we got going on here today. We got fucking Phil mid on Timbersaw. How the fuck they let this one slip through, eh? Um, well, that's pretty pog. They, I mean, they got the, the three cores are all, uh, Strength errors, I do believe. I do believe so. Oh no, Yug. No, of course not. Yug is, uh... Adgy. But still, he's against the, uh... The Magnus mid. Um... And this is a Phil Classic, so... Poetry on the Void. Uh, they're hovering around Roshan. Let's see if they can pop someone going for this River Rune. Um... 30 seconds to battle. I've seen PG. Uh, oh, sorry, PG. I've seen poetry play this void uh, before, and it was very good. Oh, we got the jargon dim on the on the on the hill. They can see them. Oh wow! Who are they going on? They they split targets. They're going to go for the mats on hood when going very low, and that's first blood for she Rolf mid. The mid hero gets the first blood. Phil's gonna be fucking raging at that. Alex spearing away, getting the bounty. And uh Phil securing the river bounty. PGV is gonna check this bounty still here. It is. Phil has not taken it yet. PGV. Mm, looking good. Nabbing that bounty there. Lovely. Um, I have no expert opinion with me. I am but a humble Archon player. But I will do my best to analyse this game. Uh, I have absolutely no idea how this matchup mid goes, but I feel already hammering down Shirov, getting very aggressive. Um, Ogre and Yag is always good. I mean, Jug with any support that has a stun is always good. So we can get on top of them with the spin. That's always a, a good lane, but Hoodwink Mars seems very annoying. Matt's her picking up Dave's courier there. And has blocked the camp with a lovely little sentry ward. Oh uh, yeah, but the, the tree stuns with, with yeah, Mars and... Hoodwink, we've seen this a couple of times in the in-houses, this combination. Um, a being very aggro, gets speared back. Mid lane. Little skirmishes here. Shirolf out leveling Phil currently. Oh, bot lane, it's all kicking off, there's a stun and spin! There we go, there's the combo we wanted to see. The stun and spin. Dim getting the last hit. But all that matters really is that the Mars is dead. And uh, I'll be very happy with that. No, Frank, I can't stream for you, buddy. Sorry, pal. Oh. Poetry leaping out of uh, of danger. Looking good. I'm not sure how. Uh... I've seen Nakukaracha play the uh, the Witch Doctor a few times, but uh, he's certainly more of a uh, pos three player, Ralph. But he can play pos four very well.
Yeah, though I'm casting Frank. I'm a Ooh. caster. Yeah, yeah. Impressive ineptitude, really. No. That Kukaracha is gonna die. Oh, Mindful comes in to save him. He just gets away, uses the south. Bill getting the solo kill mid. I missed it. I'll try and stream Frank up actually. I'm not sure. My intent's a bit shit though. Yeah. The stun. The spin. Matza. Ooh, he has to scurry away. Oh, PGV's looking very, very deep and very low health. Alex picking up the kill. Now Dave is getting body blocks and hit down. Dave. Oh, the mango from Alex. He's got a bonk. He's bonking. This ogre's so tanky. Holy shit, he's actually going to get away. Bottom tower is about to fall. Well, PGV doing very well in terms of uh, CS in this lane against the Mars. And Shearer faring well against the famous Timber mid on third. Although he did lose his life earlier. Oh, the skewer misses. Fortunate. Bill's got these reactive stacks now. Can be hyper aggressive. Missing middle. And has just got his level six. I think uh, the off lane's going pretty well for Radiant. Um, Ralph. Harassing a little bit. Support's having a skirmish. Oh, they're both very low. Who's gonna die first? Ralph, you gotta hit him. Bottom is missing. Oh, but Yak, he's got the level three. He's got he's got the E spell ready. A cucaracha is gonna have to run away. He does have maledict. And that's a dead La Cucaracha, I believe. Oh, maybe not. Oh, another solo kill mid that I've missed. But La Cucaracha is duking and jiving. And he's creating space <laughs> for his brewmaster there. Radiance middle tower is under Bottom is missing. Phil is just uh, having a great time mid at this point. Radiant Two solo kills. And he's just going to pummel the tower with this uh, siege creep. Radiance middle tower is under There's a rotation from Sheerulf bot. He doesn't have ulti yet. But he will be able to provide some assistance to the Jug. Wrapping up that kill on Mars. And here's a fortification from Radiant. Radiant is under uh, Ralph has come mid in, a, in an attempt to save the tower, but Phil's going to run him down. Oh, Phil's just diving the tower. He doesn't give a fuck. He's level 8. Oh, he missed, he missed the chakram slightly. But uh, further assistance required. Dave's TP'd here. I'm not opposed to taking the occasion. Phil just to. diving tier twos. He doesn't give a fuck. He's got the stacks. He's got the chakram. Ralph is dead, and he's forced to TP from the brew as well. Split has happened. The stun. Can Phil get out of here? Of course he can. In the meantime, Jug's farming well. Void actually being left alone top here because everyone TP'd to, to try and stop this timber. So, catching up a bit. Now they do have a very big timber issue now. Radiant you have to deal with. Alone. Fight me! Bottom is missing. 
I'll take that. All right. Phil just allowed to come mid. We do have uh, ulti on the, the Magnus now, but he has no mana. That's it. Oh. Just misses the bush. Oh no, not bush one. The other spell. Alright, um, RP is available. Oh, not anymore. He's just used it. Um, and power. So he's got no mana. Phil getting very low. Gets a kill on the shield off before dying. His team's arrived now. Alex, he has arena available. Okay, he can pop someone. That's, should be an easy kill on the ogre. But Dim's gonna go to the creeps. He's gonna say, hit me creeps. Unfortunately, Dave does fall there to the Alex. But there's a TP from Sheerolf. He wants to RP someone. Preferably more than one person. That, the, the ult he's popped by Alex, he misses the spear on Ralph. But the rest of his team's gonna clear up La Cucaracha. Missing middle! Missing top! And Phil just being left alone now. Shirov wants to try and do something about this. Missing bottom. Phil's just going to diss out some damage to make him run away. He's level 10 on Phil now. Shirov level 6. Oh, that's huge damage. What on earth are they going to do about this? Top lane. We're getting uh, harassed down a bit. Uh, Phil's arrived. Oh, he's going on the brew. The damage is unreal. Oh, brew is forced to split. In front of this uh, timber is uh, frightening. He's already got pipe. An absolute dominating performance so far from timber. Radiant catching Dave, not Dave, Yak, the Yakiro. Whilst Phil's causing all this chaos. Phil's just running at everyone, he doesn't care. Oh, that's a, that's a big ulti from Ralph, but Phil's able to get away. Omni is popped, doing no damage though. Phil's just gone back in, the RP misses from Shiro. That's a critical miss. Is Dyer going to let that middle tower fall? Radiant just fortified. Uh, Alex is pushing bot in the meantime. Is now going to be chased down by the other Alex and killed. Let's have a look at the net worth. Yeah, Phil uh, top as expected. Followed by the PGV and Void, who are fairly, fairly even. Shirov is coming top, but Patrick's gonna time walk away from that one. They want to kill the Void. Oh, and the Chrono just popped on the Witch Doctor. Easy kill there. Phil has arrived to provide additional assistance if it was required. Let's see, yeah, Jug's going for Battle Fury straight away. The Void has the Mask of Madness, probably gonna go. Classic Void build. Maelstrom. Pretty picking up the Haste Rune. Do anything with this? Just a deny. Deny the rune. Alex pops the tower bot. Phil diving the top tower. Dragon Brew have arrived to defend. 
Split is available, but just has to run away. Jog TP's away. Dave just uh, <laughs> running into timber. <laughs> Ralph popping his ulti trying to get the Jakiro. It's uh, the Maledict. Is it going to kill him? It does. Very nice. Dyer don't look too scared of Radiant's top tower. Jesus, this timber is so scary. Oh, wow, Matt's with the ulti and not allowing the brew to split in time. Phil just doing so much damage. Level 13. They do. Mats are getting very low. He's going to die to the Maledict, La Cucaracha. All right, Phil's been uh, stunned down, RP'd. They're throwing everything at this Phil now. Can they bring him down? I think they can. Oh no! The chain misses on Phil. He misses the tree and that costs him his life. Well, Radiant doing the right thing and throwing all their heroes at this timber. They had to do it. Jarg almost finishing the Battle Fury. Chronos drops on Ralph again. Gets him with the bashes. Poetry really hates this witch. Doctor's crowned at him twice now. Jex thinks Radiant's bottom tower is about to fall. He's wrong. Yeah, the brew just going straight up Ags. Seems like a mandatory item on this hero. Oh, some action top. There's an uh, Omni Slash from PGV. Killing the Jakiro, but he's getting very low. And Phil's going to finish him off with the Shaklom. And she rolls, getting bashed down and chakrammed. That's quite brutal. Uh, so the brew's gonna pick up a kill mid, perhaps. Oh, the last tick doesn't quite kill Matsa. And now Sekiro's arrived. And that's a dead brew. Well played. Well played by Dyer. Mats are just getting away with his life and providing damage with that sharpshooter ulti. Phil just, I can't keep up with this guy. Just killing everyone. He's going Sanjinkaya. And this, oh my god, look at these stacks. Alex like, Someone help me with this shit. Just gonna slowly poke them. <laughs> All right, Void should really be taking these. Actually, I think Alex is just yeah, he's just damaging them. No, nope. Alex wants to kill them. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah, Void should really be coming over to take this. But Alex is like, fuck you, Voids, this is my farm. <laughs> Typical German player. <laughs> Radiant's top tower is under attack. LOL. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, PGV. He's still uh, friendly with pretty tower. equal with the Void. Got his BF now, going for the uh, the Yasha, but still uh, the net worth discrepancy is very much in favour of Dyer, 5k ahead. Uh, this Timber very much snowballing. 
He's got the plate mail even more tanky. And there's a small smoke gank with Matza and Alex. You want to try and catch someone, maybe. Maybe the PGV. Maybe this Dave. Oh, they've, they've just bumped into the jug. They want to run away. Yeah. They're not confident about that one. But Phil is. Phil just wants to run in. Omni's popped. And Phil just chains away from it. He's just going to go for the Mars. Is going to get the kill on the Mars. Phil jumping the back line a bit. Split is popped. Void will be controlled for a brief moment. There is a Chrono available if needed. Again, the boy gets tornadoed. Dave, I think Dave's going to fall. Girls hunting down this brute. Oh, and the RP comes out on the Void, but the bushwhack from Matsa controls two of Radiant's heroes and Poetry's going to fall though. It's uh, it's worth it in the end. PGB's looking very low. Bill finishes them off. There is a, uh, a Shadow Blade on this Magnus. Wants to run at them. Maybe catch the Matza. It's not going to happen off damage. Oh, narrowly avoids the Ice Bath but gets caught in the bushwhack. Phil will claim that kill for himself. La Cucaracha is getting bullied here. Even getting blocked by Alex when invis. What a player. And uh, Radiant just uh, falling short on these recent fights. Jax thinks Radiant's bottom tower is about Lotus ready and available on Phil. Dave getting dived hard. Huge damage. Sharpshooter just missing. PGV coming to defend. Boyd's running top with Chrono. Will he Chrono the Brew? I think he will. Where's the damage though? This is a tanky boy. Can the split be. Oh, the Diffusal Blade. He's got no mana. This brood can't do anything. He's just going to have a Duke and Jive in the trees. And I think that's a dead brew. Poetry well played. Phil in the meantime still here in this mid lane. Omni is available. Going for Sanjin Yasha next on Jug. Um, RP will be available momentarily. Um, Chrono's down, so this is a good timing for Radiant to maybe get a kill on the Void. He is alone. Stun from Dave. The RP. Lovely clean up there. But Phil still here picking off these these heroes in mid. He can just stay here forever. Do Radiant want their middle power to fall? Alex going for the BKB on Mars. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. Oh, Max is going for this uh, Wind right, Wind Waker shit. Do Radiant want their middle power to fall? Dyer's top Jug pushing tower. hard, TPing home. Mate. Radiant's middle tower is under attack. It's not every day you get to see Radiant's Silver middle Edge tower fall. Silver Edge on the mag. Just an upgraded Shadow Blade. Void just farming away. Jog is significantly ahead of the Void now. Almost 2k gold ahead. So farming well, but he has been caught here in the Chrono, not the Chrono, the, the, the Mars ulti. He manages to spin away, but there's still three dire heroes around him, including this fucking Timbersaw. Has to Omni to get the kill on Yakiro. His team's arrived though, and he's safe. 
Phil is looking at very much in danger at the moment. Oh, the chain misses. There's no tree, Phil. There's no tree. Shiro claiming the kill on Phil. That is a valuable kill. An eight kill streak on Phil was finished there. Going 13 3 currently. PGV actually almost catching up with a timber, only about 1k gold behind the timber now. He's becoming a fat boy, going for Basher next. Well, oh, Radiant actually responding really well to the timber threat. They're only 1k gold behind now, so this is anyone's game. And a Chrono on the jug though, Poetry. Oh, and a Sharpshooter does so much damage, gets the kill on the PGV. Radiant have to respond to this. Oh, and they do so very well with the RP on the Void. And that's a carry for carry trade. Radiant looking for more. They want to catch this uh, this little squirrel hero. But they won't be able to, unfortunately. Alex hiding in the trees as well. Which my matriarch will prize. Well, oh, I didn't, didn't catch this. Alex popping the ulti to get a kill on the brute. The assistance of Matsu. Radiant's courier has been killed. They've doing some dewarding duties and a small bit of jungling. There's a huge, uh, a huge line drawn by Phil saying, "Get." into the bottom jungle that's where they are let's go he's in uh, he has minimal backup currently he's got his two other cores just farming um, but maybe he doesn't need them I don't know it appears uh, Alex is like fuck your line Phil I'm staying here Poetry, I suppose. Uh, I suppose they're waiting for their ultis to be available before they fight, but... Well, she rolls. There's no vision on Dyer. Where's the vision? Oh, the dust misses. She rolls. Trying... Oh, gets a cheeky kill on Phil's courier and TP's away. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Ira's middle tower didn't last long. Double damage. They're roaching on Radiant. PGV with DD. Will he pop on me for this? He will. And that is a dead fill. PGV number one net worth now. This jug is big. He's got the basher. Whilst he's finishing off Roche, his team's gonna fight. There's a Chrono drop, two-man Chrono, Poetry. Trying to bash down the she but oh! Yeah, there's no vision, there's no vision on Dyer. And now PGV has Aegis. Oh, Poetry, oh! So much damage with that ulti. On that Cucaracha. That's four dead on Dyer. Wow, and now they're 2k gold ahead. Bottom tower is under attack. Phil's early lead in mid is uh, meaningless at this point. I'll take that as tribute. Unable to convert it to the mid lane, mid game with his team. Or perhaps just Radiant outplaying them. Doing very well. This jug. Fallen. Just been farming, killing, taking Dyer's smart fights, going for the Abyssal Blade fight. next. Dyer's top tower has some radiant shape problems. Dyer needs to regroup.
Mats are going for Orchid next. Um... Dave just constantly buffing the jug like a true ogre player. BKB coming up on Brute. Alex has ulti available. Doesn't need to pop it, perhaps. The split's out though. Phil will get tornadoed. The pandas. Oh, now PGV has joined the fight. He's just going to hit Phil. He's just going to hit Phil. Try and spin him down. The stun. Panda's doing good work. she -Rolf has RP. Get speared away. And Alex is going to die. Baku Karacha claiming a double kill. In the meantime, Poetry gets this tower, the tier 2. Has Chrono available, he's going to TP home. Max is going to split push as well. Whilst Radiant begin to siege the high ground. It's dark now. Three, over 3k gold ahead of Timber. And even the Magnus is catching up with the, the Timber. Oh, that's a nullified Omni as Void just time walks away. And he has Aegis on Jug, so this doesn't matter too much if he dies. But Healing Ward is popped. And Dyer unable to defend the tower, but I don't think Radiant will be able to get much more. Okay, perhaps uh, is Roshan up? It is not. There is a DD though. Magnus has got the AC. Ralph gives him a little whip. The DD. Jog going Axe next, I think that's a good choice. Time is money. Axe is a wonderful item for Jug. Gets the bottle DD on Jug as well. Poetry going for the Satanic next. The bounty which my matriarch will prize. Possibly gonna upgrade his Mosque of Madness. Phil with the bloodstone, okay. Dyer might not have a middle barracks for long. Radiant looking to make a play here. I haven't seen many smokes uh, coming out from either team. But Radiant is going to run at them. They just run up the high ground. Oh, and there's a three man chrono by Poetry. Alex drops his ulti in the back. She Rolf getting very low, but is able to just walk away. Jog getting very low. Oh, the spin saves him from the ice path. She Rolf RPs the void. Oh, wow, they both fall in the end. Jog is caught though. Has to Omni at the safety. Phil gets Omni'd down hard by this DD Jog. Wow, that was a chaotic fight. It's hard to keep up with what the fuck was going on there. But all in all, Radiant coming out on top. PGV with a wonderful performance on Jug. Really, really well played by PGV. Sitting happily at number one net worth, and they're going to start hitting tier fours. Phil, no buyback. Void, no buyback. 
This could be GG. There may be one last fight. Void up in nine seconds. The Ancient is exposed. Alex has to pop his ulti, but PGV spins to avoid the spear. That's a dead Alex. Why oh, is back immediately void? Is he gonna be asked to there's no chrono available? There's no chrono available. He's just gonna have to bash. He's just gonna have to pray for the RNG. And he does fall. Feels feels alive now. Dog's getting very low, they might be able to kill him. Phil is extremely tanky now. Doug uh, opting to back away and leave his team. But all in all, that was a very successful siege. The Ancients exposed. Radiant will have to regroup now. And all in all, the Jug didn't die. But Dyer did defend it. It was looking uh, very, very wor worrying. But the game will, will go on. Jog has the Ags now. And Omni available. Phil farming his Ancients, he's just gonna run into... He's still gonna run into each other. I'm not sure if... Uh, they knew about this. Alex! Oh! PGV Omniing to dodge the spear. But now he's very much alone. Use a Swiss Flash. Gets down the Alex. She Wolf is here to provide assistance. Dave has the shard of the fire shield. Extra tank hit us and Phil falls. Double kill for PGV. That's not what Dyer wanted. Surely Braden are just going to run into the base now. Void does have Chrono though. Roshan is up. They could take Rosh if they wanted to, but they decide to go and hit the Ancient. There's a Chrono. Phil's brought back for this. Radiant deciding it's now or never. Jug gets Chronoed. And that's going to be... The Jug's going to die. There's too much damage from, from the Void. But the rest of Radiant, the Pandas are just hitting the throne. They're going to fortify. Oh, the RP misses. Poetry, what a player. He time walks away from him, but jumps back in. Oh, and he dies to the Maledict. Oh, and the Ancient's falling. Dave just hitting it, and that's GG. Oh, what a game. What a game. Very well played by all involved. PGV, what a god.